Hey guys, this is Daenerys Lewis. Welcome to the YouTube page. What we're going to talk about today is what rim, what women really want. And that's a, always a touchy subject and what women really want. I'm not a woman, but I listen to a lot of my female friends. A majority of the people I hang out with all girls. I grew up with all women. Um, uh, I have two older sisters and I'm the youngest, so I'm the only boy in the family. So my aspect and um, experience of what women really want is a little bit different, so I can actually... Um, feel like I can speak up for them. Uh, what women really want, they want a person who's willing to jump through obstacles for them. A person who's willing to show them that, hey, despite what's going to happen, despite the, uh, despite the problem we, what we're facing, I'm still willing to be with you. Um, women want a person who's going to motivate them and make them feel more of a comfortable um, human being to bring out what they thought they didn't have, which is whatever they thought it didn't have like for example um i can go back to when i went to my freshman year in college and a lot of the girls um their main problem was their boyfriends were their boyfriends were weren't treating them right and i don't understand how you can be in a relationship or even enter a relationship that could that could go sour I feel that if you're a wise enough person, if your emotions are truly keen, and if you really want something that's going to benefit you, and if you want to keep yourself around people who are going to benefit you, you're only going to, you're only going to find that that one person that's going to be there. Now, obviously, every relationship is different. A majority of people, um, for you to truly find out some, about someone, you have to date them and go through the sour patches of um, accepting who they are. But that's not always true. You can always uh, find the sour patch in a person without truly um, sitting, sitting sitting down and jumping in a relationship with the person. Get to know the person at, beforehand. Um, a lot of what women really want, they want a man who's going to bring the best out of them when even when they're the, when they feel like they're at their worst. And I, I don't have a problem with, I'm really comfortable with women. You can cry, you're still beautiful. You can have hair on your legs, you can have all these things that you feel that you're insecure about, but at the end of the day, what you feel insecure about is what you are telling yourself you're insecure. A man is going to, a woman wants a man who's going to build their confidence through their actions and through their emotions and through their words. And for example, a lot of these women think makeup is going to make them beautiful, uh, bring out their confidence. No, the person you're standing there, the, the person you're standing next to is the, what's going to build your confidence. Um, I could care less about makeup. I'm not a person who wears makeup. I would look pretty in makeup. But I don't use makeup because <laughs> I don't need to. Uh, my personality is going to reflect um, more than what my appearance will ever have to say for itself. Um, for example, when I was a kid, um, I had a relationship with a girl and she told me she only dated me because I had nice abs. But she said, I, she said, your face is not what I'm looking for. I'm only dating you because of your body. Completely fat. I heard this in fifth grade, um, actually sixth grade, she was a fifth grader, and it took a toll on me emotionally, like, and I really was sad, and I tried to eat myself, make myself look fat so I could lose my body, uh, because, and that's where, at an early age, I learned that despite your physical appearance is not, your, your physical appearance is something cool, but if they're not going to like you for who you are in the inside, they're not a person that you should be with. That's completely a fact. But if a guy can't accept you, or if a female can't accept you for who you are on the inside rather than what you appear on the outside, dump them, get away from that person, and surround yourself around people who are going to be happy that you are alive. That they found, found the connection with a the person they can hold a conversation with rather than just stare at. I mean, you cut the lights off with the person, but you don't see the person. Now, if I cut the lights off of the person and I can hold a conversation with that person, I'm going to be more engaged and with and having a communication with them. So, um, a lot of the, uh, what a woman really wants is a person who can build them and make them happy. Um, comment below, guys, in regards to what... Comment below, females, anyone who's watching this, comment below what you think women really want and how they can achieve that. Again, this is Denarius Lewis. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Um... And I'd love to see what you guys have to say for yourself. Thank you guys for watching.